Ladies and gentlemen, in the red corner, weighing 69.8 kilos, height 6 foot 2, two fights, one win, one loss, no draws. From Preston, representing Preston Reps, Adrian Hyden. In the blue corner, weighing 7.6 kilos, height 6 foot, two fights, no wins, two losses, no draws. From Barrow, representing Barrow MMA, Team Spartan, Andy Nevinson. Yeah, the place is packed and it looks great and everyone's in good voice. Yep. Uh, the crowd are, are shouting as always and this is how we like it. The fight, fight's about to uh, be underway. We've got Adrian Halladin from Preston Reps versus Andy Nevinson, Team Spartan Barrow MMA. Would it be slightly biased for me to just pick Andy Nevinson based on his <laughs> ring music? <laughs> you, you can pick whoever you want based on whatever you like, buddy. Well, there you um, go. I coach Andy Nevinson and he's a very nice kid, yep. he's a tough kid, he, he fights well, he's oh. uh, a bit erratic, but um, if he can settle in... Well, some, sometimes that can work well for you. It can. Um, Halladin looks really strong, very oh, long, yes. very tough. Oh, he's going for a takedown. Oh. The takedown stuff there. Yeah. Uh, he's got a, a guillotine choke possibly, he's trying for that guillotine choke. He would need to turn him out. Definitely, to yeah. To work. Well, a couple of blows to the side there from Nevinson. Andy pushing Knee. away using knees. Not letting him get that hand in to secure no. that guillotine choke. He really needs to force his head high. He can't be seen with his head low. Yeah, try to protect the windpipe. Got keep the air. Yeah. Keep the air flow and, and keep the blood flow. A few knees to the thighs, that'll soften him up a little bit. I mean, in this position, it's tough to shout. Foot stomps and knees are fine. Yeah. Anything you can do really to regain your leverage again. That's I mean, that's it. the key you to don't break want to go this. To sleep. That's what you don't want yeah. to go to sleep right now. I mean, we saw in the last bout. He's fighting through it really well. Yeah. Now he's got his back to the cage. He's not in a good position here. No. He's not in a good place whatsoever. He's got nowhere he needs to go. To fight this. He needs to fight it. it. Looks like he's coming out. Very. He's trying to fight his way. Adrian Very strong lad. Yeah. I think he's more around the jaw than the neck at the moment. I think he's got his hand in in place and, and securing it. Right, yeah, you can see yeah. it, definitely. He's squeezing away. Point, it's very, very tight. Yeah. Oh, nice he's trying to break out. Yes, I think he's getting it. Yes. Yeah, he's out. He's out. Oh, oh. Bit of stand up boxing nice. here. Nice, Nevins is rocking. Both guys back in. hands and feet. Both guys really wanting to fight now. Oh, he's going for a takedown again. Oh. I was a bit close to right comfort. Yeah. We don't like that look. No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God those shorts are long. That's all I'm saying. Defending that takedown really well is Halladin. Yeah. His posture, his movement, everything is really good for that takedown defence. Andy working really hard to get him down. Now he's fighting that guillotine again. He's oh, the they've done the floor now. And he's got him in full guard, full guillotine. Yeah, he needs to get his head to the floor, get up on his feet and push his head to the floor. Squeezing around the ribs, trying to, like, try to like, stop him from getting the air floor, yeah, back into the lungs again. Squeezing the ribs to constrict the air floor. Andy's looking okay. He's not looking in a lot of trouble. His head's about out of here. Position. Here we go. This is a good position. Pound pound. He relaxes now and takes his time. He needs to relax and take his time. He's going to mount him. He's going for an armbar. Oh, he's going for an armbar. He's fighting it off. He's controlling well. Time up. Oh, what end of round one. Round. What a fantastic a difficult, then. Really difficult round to score. Uh, both fighters gave it their all. Both were throwing really well. Um, I think. Purely for, uh, for his tenacity, I don't know. I think Halladin might have taken that one. He I did have him in that really guillotine for a really long time. Difficult to say, but Andy fought out of it. That's the thing. He did. So you know, I wouldn't, all... like, wouldn't like the judge's job. No, that's a fact. Well, it's all a fight for in round two. Absolutely, definitely, yeah. I think uh, if Andy doesn't go for that same takedown again, maybe if he switches to a single leg, perhaps try something different. Yeah. No. Well, if you expect yeah. him to come out of the gates and probably do the same thing again, I mean, you've got to switch you it up think. to I keep going. You're going to have to change things up. I think you definitely hurt him with those foot stomps. Oh, were, yeah. You know, that's something that we train quite hard at Barrow and I mean, I mean, you can see in Halladin, there's a little bit colour on the back. He's getting a couple of blows in. He must be feeling them. That's the yeah, thing. I would say round two about to start. All to fight for. Both Here we guys go. looking fresh though. We're locking the cage up again. Here we go. 
good to have you beside me, Billy. I know you're a last minute standing for us, and I really appreciate you coming along when you no do. No worries, Bob. As soon as you asked me, I was straight in. The other guys that were meant to come, unfortunately, had other things to do at the last minute, so uh, a shout out to both of them, Rick Belter and Adam Tay. Um, maybe next time, guys, or if not, we'll just get Billy back. Well, yeah. Oh, there's a big right hand from Andy Neff. Oh. Big right hand, and Halladin's going for the take Yeah, now. he's trying to take that, he's got him down. He's got the same chokehold that Halladin had in the first round. Yeah. I can't see from here, from my vantage point, how tight that is. But he's squeezing it in. But it looks tight. It does. It looks Never tight. to squeeze the ribs again. Oh, he's, he's out, away. And he's opening his arm back. pounding. There's a definite leg lock there. Yeah. And he wants to go for it. There's a definite leg oh, lock. Oh, he's getting something in. It. Well, that's to switch his right leg round. Halladin's left. Hook it under his own. Push him to the ground. He's leaving himself open here. Gonna get some ground and pound if he isn't very, yeah. very careful right now. Oh, how His corner team down. need to be shouting to him. They need to be instructing him, telling him what to do. There doesn't seem to be a lot going on from the corners, really. Well, you'd be surprised. It's a different world altogether being in that corner as it is being here, watching from our vantage point. Yeah, that, you know, I know you know that firsthand from you know I've all the cornered hundreds together, yeah. of fights, and uh, yeah, I've, I've been. Uh, it's been my pleasure to uh, to look after a lot of lads over the years and, and help them out any way I can. It's a little bit different doing this though, this commentary. Well, you know, it's, it, I suppose it's a bit of a refreshing not to get involved in the whole drama so much and you know, the emotions. It is. I mean, it's it from outside. I mean, enough emotions and drama for me actually putting the show on in the first place. Well, I uh, imagine so. It's been. Probably three months it's taken to get the show together. Yeah. We've ended up with 11 excellent fights, all well matched, uh, if I do say so myself. Well, there you go. I am the matchmaker after all. I'm just glad I was able to come on the scene and maybe sell a couple uh, of hundred tickets got for you. A Von Flu choke, and he's gone. He's out. Paladin wins with a Von Flu choke. Excellent work. Congratulations, Congratulations to uh, Mr. Halladin. Halladin. Yep. And unlucky to Andy Nevinson. That's his third that loss. Fight? Third consecutive loss. I don't know how that'll knock him. Um, I can only wish him well for, for more fights in the future. Ladies and gentlemen, so Bob, fighters appreciation, big round of applause. In the second round, after 1 minute 51 seconds, referee stopped the fight to submission with a Von Flew chalk. Learning myself. Big round of applause from Preston, representing Preston Reps, Adrian Halladin.